So this is going to sound really familiar because it's very similar to policy analysis. At this point, we're going to use our findings to determine the outcomes of our program evaluation. And so at this point, we can consult the data. We're going to look at what the numbers for each indicator are and decide where those numbers fall in those predetermined ranges that we established while we were operationalizing our questions. So if we remember the, the summertime lunch distribution program, and I asked the output question of how many children are being fed by the program or receiving lunches, I've decided to use registrations as the data point that's going to answer this question. And I look at my uh, summer 2022 numbers and I find that 1,698 children registered for the summer lunch program. Um, and so I look back at the conditions that I've established and I find that that number falls within the neutral range. And now you're going to do this process for each of your questions and indicators that you've identified. And in the next lesson, we're going to make sense of what we do with that information.